Hi, this is Carly from Family Tree Notebooks, and in this video I'm going to tell you how to build your own family tree book. Don't worry, it's very, very easy. The first thing you're going to do is you're going to look for the available pages at FamilyTreeNotebooks.com. Browse around and then find the pages you want, purchase them, and from there you're going to download them to your device. Most people start with a deluxe bundle because the deluxe bundles come with 200 pages and that's plenty to make a family tree book. If you do want more pages later, you can always add them a la carte for a very low price. Once you've purchased your pages, you're going to find a download link on your receipt. Sometimes it's also emailed to you. Either way, download that zip file to your device. Now it's easiest to put it on your computer and then double click it and that'll unzip the file. And from there, you can move it onto your tablet. So buy it, download it to your computer, and then move it onto your tablet if you're going to be using a tablet to make your pages. Otherwise, you can just leave them on your computer and use your computer to make the pages. Now, when you buy the pages, they are blank digital PDFs. They're not fillable, so you do need a program to add text and photos to them. This is where some people get hung up. It's not hard to find a program that you can use. Just know that you will need something extra. Personally, I use GoodNotes 5. That's a program that works with Apple products. You can see here that I'm adding text and photos using my iPad and an Apple Pencil. I also have a tutorial for Adobe Acrobat. There are lots of programs out there that let you add text and photos to a PDF. So try some out and just find whatever feels comfortable for you. You don't have to spend a ton of money. There are definitely free and inexpensive options. Once you've finished your page, go ahead and print that out and then add it to your family tree book. That's all you have to do. Put the pages together by grouping information about your ancestor using the provided index numbers and then put your ancestors together in order uh, according to generations. And after a while, you will have built an entire book of your family tree without even trying. It really is that simple. All you have to do is just gather your information, make a page at a time, print out a page at a time, add one page here, two pages there to the book, start building up these ancestor chapters, and eventually you're going to have something that you're going to be ready to share with your family or whoever else. Just remember, work at your own pace, use pages that fit the stories that you want to tell, make sure that you have a good time, and if you ever get stuck, just reach out to me. It's carly at familytreenotebooks.com.